Hey everybody, how y'all doing? This is Dave. Uh, I hadn't made a video in a pretty good while, but I've been watching something here, and uh, it's playing out just like it, like uh, like it's supposed to. And I wanted to, I wanted to make a quick video and show it to you. This is a long-term uh, Fibonacci, and I just want to show you how Fibonacci's work and how strong they are. What you're looking at here is a six-month chart. You can see I started this Fibonacci on April 26, uh, 2010. And I drew it down to uh, a low. At that time it was low. Uh, 10.36 and 3 quarters on May 25th. Well, that gave us two retrace numbers. The first one, the 50%, was 11.26 and 3 quarters. And you can look right here. You can see where it came up and hit that and moved way down. You can see right here where it consolidated for about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 trading days. And it moved way down. And then we broke through it. But, uh, you know, there's two resistance numbers. Our next one being 61.8, 1147.99. Now, what I want you to do is pay close attention. Uh, right here, and, and I've got it text out. 1147.99 is long term resistance and has held like a rock. This is a sign of a move to the downside, and, and that's exactly what I think is going to happen. As you can see, once it broke through the 50, it moved up to the uh, 61.8. And what we're going to do, we're going to zoom in here a lot tighter where you can see it better. And just look what happens. Uh, or what is happening right here at the 47.99 level, uh, and you can call that 11.48 or 11.47 three quarters. But look right here; it's coming up and back. It's coming up and back. It's it's coming up. It, it goes through it just a little bit. That's okay, because uh, we're concerned about the close, not not where the wick goes, but where it closes. Uh, up here, back. Up here, back. Up here, back. Up here, back. Uh, comes right up to it. Back. Comes right up to it. Back. Uh, so you got, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight trading days where it's, uh, it's beating on this 61A line and it's not able to get through it. That reinforces my downside target of 994.27. Keep that number in mind, folks, because that's where we're headed. And then after that, we're headed to 990. And then after that, we're headed to 901.50. Bark that down in your little black book. Hey, y'all have a good day out there. I always use a stop, and I will talk to you later.